RMEF course. Let's do it. Thank you. Yeah, I'm getting 53. Okay, here we go. 53, middle pin. I think I hit the cedar tree right here in front of us. I'm like high. Kind of low. Yeah. Low. Yeah. <laughs> Your arrow might be alive. You had to have hit that stump and bounced off. I guess, yeah, right here. Yeah. Hey, I thought I was losing my insert for sure. You were? I thought I was going to lose that insert for sure. Sure. 74 yards is what I'm dialed to. And this is a beautiful little window to shoot through. Hit the limb, and I have no idea what happened after that. So. I never saw it after that. Mm. You're a little bit faster, bow doesn't have to arc up and hit that branch like mine does. It's a hundred percent what it was. It's right here. I'm not the only one. That's a freaking dead elk right there, is what that is. There's one of my fletchings. Oh, here's an arrow right here. <clears throat> and that sucker is broken. You are the luckiest mother. <laughs> this is your arrow. Oh, shit. Yeah. I can't freaking believe that. I can't believe that. To lose. Found your damn arrow and I lost both of mine. It means more when you do that and you lose your arrow like I do every time. I don't know, that's what I'm calling it. You know, like whiskey throttle, like on a dirt bike where you just can't stop because you're holding on to it. Kind of the same thing. No, that's probably from the last one. Oh, when it hit the tree? Mm hmm. Oh, it's, it's just a smaller target right here. Definitely can make that with my top pin. How far can you typically go with your top pin? Well, it's just as far until you run into contact right here with mm -hmm. your fletchings. You can go as far as you can go. Beautiful morning. It is. No wind. Mm -hmm. It'd be nice to shoot some better shots with no wind for me. <laughs> it just is. I just gotta shoot more. It's looking like 52 or 53. Well, I mean, there's flushing and, and the stickers and all that. Yeah, but okay, top pin. There you go. 
go. That's a good shot. Good lord. That's a 12 ring. And I didn't lose my arrow. Still alive? Yep. Oh yeah, dude. Lucky mother. Score. Uh, 12 rings a dead animal, that's all I care about. I just want to see if we can... It is fun. It's very Especially fun. Especially when the Mexicans out of lift and... Oh yeah, that would be so, so fun. Uh-huh. And, uh... Okay. Should be a little better now. Thank you. Yeah, it just so you... I mean, your string is like three or four years old now mm -hmm. so it's just naturally it's gonna don't you're shooting it a lot now so it's gonna start to stretch a little bit and you're gonna get a little bit of peep rotation from it it's weird super weird i mean i was like stupid you. little okay. well you're drilling it now that's two dead oak you, get a sweatshirt. you gotta find you a backup one now just in case <laughs> if you chill, you're good. we're not in any rush man all right cool i like that okay Unless you want to. No, I'm good. I'm enjoying just filling the top. Yeah, yeah, dude. I'm dude. happy with the height. You can take a picture of that. Yeah, this is a dense target. Yeah. It makes you go, holy smokes. Yeah. Yeah, that's, I mean, an elk would still be bigger than that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Clear. That shot felt good, like I did it right. It did look good. It smoked it. What are you getting on it? 71. 72. I'm getting 71 right on the money. Middle pin 71, that's what I'm shooting. Looks good. At the top of the second circle. Sweet. Sweet. Up above yours. I got a branch above it. Low, low, low. So, what is your opinion on how the two pin like that is a vertical pin uh -huh. rather than horizontal pins? I what? like it. You like it? I do like it. It's the, I like less, the less clutter. Okay. Yeah, so for me, there's something about the vertical pin that I can't do. I don't know why. All right. I like the big target. <laughs> it helps. This is a longer shot for sure. It's not as long as I thought, 70. Basically shoot shoot for the same thing as yet as last target. Alright, we got nothing in the way, so. Felt good. A little high vitals, but that's okay. Still not happy totally with my shot execution, but oh, right over the top, kind of where that. Where his longer tine is at the mm -hmm. top of his antlers. No, I, I tend to hold my breath a lot. Mm -hmm. Thinking it's going to settle it when it doesn't. Mm -hmm. 
target's a lot smaller once you get up here. I bet your tar your arrow's still alive back in there somewhere. Wouldn't surprise me. With your luck. Your luck with finding your arrows. You could make a bunch of arrows out of all these dead ones. Sounds good. Oh yeah, he drilled him. I hit him a little back. Sweet. Good deal. The live oak flats and all that. Yep. Looks just like it. So just so much can go wrong. Even in perfect conditions, you never know. Yeah. I'd try to stay within 60 probably, just for, to be safe about it. Mm -hmm. Out to 82 right now. That is the fun part, watching your arrow coming. Oh yeah, I love watching it arc like that. Yeah, I would have hit the lungs. A little back, but your your elevation is great. Right up here, it's like, man. I think so. Yeah. God, that boat body foam is so dense. Well, that was good. That was a good one. A little less mountain climbing on this course. So far. So far. Well, yeah, but it makes me want to do it again more. Oh, yeah. How's it going? Second time I went out. You're still great. Mm -hmm. Like double on. It has definitely helped because I'm, uh, like you said, I'm, I'm uh, extending my bow arm more. Yep. So it's making it easier to. To force your pen steady a little bit. Yes. Yeah. I'm surprised there's not more obliterated arrows right there than that. So all this makes me want to do is practice a hell of a lot more. It's nine, it is so easy to get in your head. Yeah. You have to draw the line of knowing between, okay, it was just me. Or I gotta fine tune my like my sight. Working with this, it's just one extra step, though. You know, you're walking through and you don't have a clip to your string. You have to look down and clip to your string and then look back up. It's the only thing that wrist strap you can do it without looking. Way back in there. But he's still like at any way. second he can turn his head. That's a 95 yarder. 94.
Well, just hustle down and grab him. And then. Ooh, you got a much better shot than this. We figured we'd pop this one and hustle, all right? All right? And then when y'all get done with that one, y'all are gonna have us on the well. Yeah. I barely caught that <laughs> neck. <laughs> Just to barely catch it. You're a little high, but... What the hell? My freaking insert flew off after I went through. Oh, well. No, no we didn't hit the tree. Okay. It was right under it. <laughs> you got your brushes? <laughs> Probably a lot slower than yours. <laughs> I don't know. If you had yeah. to guess, what would you guess? Based on what you know. Probably like 260. I got some pretty heavy points. So. Yeah, I shoot 255. Okay. Or did you have enough clearance? I had enough. Okay. For the tree right here, you're talking? Any tree. I didn't have any. Issue. I didn't have any issue on this one. On the last one, I hit the limb. I've hit three trees today. Okay. All decent shots. Yeah, the last one with that bedded elk and that tree that's like 25, 30 yards in front of you. I hit. 70 right here. Speaking of trees. <laughs> Is there anything in front of it? No. Are you right? Yep. Oh, you got my roof. Yeah. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me? A lot of people do the hot melt. I just don't get it. With broadheads and field points? Yeah. I don't get it. I don't think I did anything wrong. I think that was 9 and 10 right there. Or maybe 10 and 11. Yeah, it was 10 and 11. There's 12 right here. I'm getting 62 and a half. Does that seem right? Dude, that's a dead elk right there. That's a good shot. Oh, we do keep walking. The last however many were kind of pulling her turn, so I just was used to it. It's crazy. I mean, it looks so much farther off back there than when you get up here. But this is a little bitty target. All right. Cool. Good shot. That was a good one for both of us. I think, I mean, both of those would have been kills. So it looks like we go up that way. Mm -hmm. And maybe we curl back that way to get back to the gate. Yep. So, cool. All right. This is a pretty close shot. great height it's a little back but sure is. height's good what? it's a solid shot that one felt really good, good. I thought it was a bigger target it's really only 43 yards it's a little target Good, good shot. Low. Is it low? Mm -hmm. I think. I didn't look through my binoculars. Let's go check it out. So on that one, are you sure you didn't dial your dial to your bottom pin, but aim with your top pin? I'm sure. 
Okay. Nothing in the way, just gotta dump it over the top of those, that yeah. grass. Dude, that flew beautifully. That was perfect shot. That was that was a great one to end on. <laughs> it was sailing through there pretty good. All right, we did it. Yes, we did. Well done.